the name of my project is uh, Cyber Physical Network Systems. Uh, I'm interested in building uh, the next generation of intelligent transportation systems. The main inspiration for my team uh, is uh, natural examples of complex systems such as flocks of birds or swarms of ants. We are trying to benefit from the mechanisms that birds use to avoid collision to create a safer transportation system uh, which allows people to switch to an automated mode in their car and go with the flow. The main computational challenge uh, for each vehicle is to keep track of all the moving obstacle around it. The moving obstacles could be other neighboring vehicles, could be a biker, could be the pedestrians, could be the divider in the road. It takes significant amount of sensing and information processing as well as computation to track multiple objects around a single vehicle. This project relies on the use of uh, miniature mobile robots uh, called Kepra 3. They're built in Switzerland. They're wheeled robots with numerous sensors on them. The sensors uh, include IR sensors, uh, sonar sensors. They're miniature uh, mobile robots. One of the main capabilities of these cars is that they're capable of detecting whether the driver is actually drunk or not, or is distracted or not. If the car detects such behaviors, it would take over the control of the car from the driver. This could be uh, perceived as intrusion of um, civil liberties uh, and privacy of individual drivers. Therefore, it's important to consult with philosophers, ethicists, psychologists, and other social scientists uh, as this project develops. The seed money from the Newcom Institute allows me uh, to get uh, all the equipment and test, uh, test beds that I need to build to start my research and get going and get some initial results and then use those initial results to apply for a much bigger project from funding institutions that could be multi-million dollar projects. Uh, without the seed money, I won't be able to uh, get started on my project.